I remember asking for a signature when she was in year nine, saying you will definitely win an Olympic medal. One of my best moments, there was sports day. I started the 200 metre race. She'd finished the race before the rest of the children had got to the 100 metre mark. She was just off. She progressed to her sprinting and got better and better by working harder and harder. So who was it who inspired you? Kelly Holmes. Winning two Olympic golds was incredible. But what I really liked was the fact that the winners got like a crown or a wreath. Next Olympics I didn't have them and I remember asking my mum, like, isn't that Olympics, the, the whole Greek vibe? She was like, no, it's because it was in Athens. I was like, oh. I was like, <laughs> I was like well, I'm, I'm already trying to be an athlete now, so I might as well keep going. <laughs> I've been fortunate enough to know Dina since she was that high, and she's now that high. <laughs> he's like a second dad to me, and obviously he's completely changed my life. Final change! Great Britain and Northern Ireland, silver! Silver for Dina Asher-Smith, what a run, brilliant finish here by the Britons. People see her here training, they get inspired by her. I feel like if she can be that good, I can be that good too. She wins quite a lot of awards, but she's very humble about it. It teaches kids that they should always try their best and never boast about it. I doubt you'll find someone more passionate, more hardworking. We call her the bee's knees, our queen bee. She's a legend. Watch for the start then, Asha Smith out in lane seven has gone out very quickly indeed, looking to take Brown with her inside Bryant as well. Asha Smith has gone blazing through the first 100 metres and leads into the straight. The Americans either side of her, Bryant and Brown. Asha Smith holding her form. Has she got the strength here? She's moving away. Dina Asha Smith, the best of British, is finally on top of the world. 21.89. It's history for Great Britain. Yeah!